Let's face it, chords suck. And the last thing you need in a big online fight is to have your cat or dog run by and snag themselves on your headphone cable and nearly breaking your neck. So today I'm going to share with you my picks for the top 5 wireless gaming headsets that have stood out for one reason or another as a great pick to add to your gaming arsenal. The Razer Black Shark version 2 Pro is one of the best wireless gaming headsets for the PC. While its isolation isn't as good as its wired Black Shark version 2 brother, its microphone improvements and solid wireless performance make it easy to recommend. Compared to the earlier 2020 version, the Black Shark version 2 has improved mic performance, a significant longer lasting battery life, and supports Bluetooth so you can receive audio from your phone while gaming. That said, their lack of an aux port means you can't use them wired and they don't come in console specific variants, so if you're an Xbox gamer, you'll want to look elsewhere for a wireless gaming headset. They have 70 hours of continuous playback time to outlast long dungeon crawls and a comfortable fit to keep fatigue at bay. Their sound packs extra bass to help emphasize sound effects like footsteps, but if you prefer a different sound, their companion software offers a graphic equalizer and presets. The boom mic also offers good overall performance so teammates and enemies alike will hear you clearly. Of all the headsets on this list, these have the best sounding microphone and at its low price point, it's easy for me to pick these as best budget gaming headset. The HyperX Cloud 3 wireless are comfortable and well-built gaming headphones that offer decent sounding audio in a surprisingly affordable package. The manufacturer advertises a continuous battery life of 120 hours, which is impressive compared to wireless gaming headsets from other manufacturers. They offer low latency wireless performance via a USB dongle and feature the same sturdy and comfortable design as their wired counterpart, the HyperX Cloud 3s. Extra features are accessible through the HyperX Ingenuity Companion software to tweak the sound profile with a graphic EQ to activate the DTSX spatial sound for a multi-dimensional audio experience. The HyperX Cloud 3 wireless are a good choice for wireless gaming. They're well built and comfortable enough for marathon gaming sessions. The only downside with this headset, which might not be a downside for you, is that the Cloud 3 wireless only sports one connectivity option. 2.4 GHz wireless with a USB-C dongle, which makes it compatible with a variety of devices, but unable to connect with more than one device at a time. If you can live with this one oversight, then the HyperX Cloud 3 wireless should be a consideration on your list. The big shining feature of the Corsair HS80 Max Wireless is the amount of different devices it is able to connect to. This headset features support for PC, Mac, PS5, and PS4 over a 2.4 GHz wireless connection using the included USB adapter, but can also be paired to Nintendo Switch and standard mobile devices over Bluetooth. Unfortunately, it cannot be used with Xbox, which is a real shame. The 2.4 GHz connection sounds great and remains crystal clear up to 50 feet away, allowing you to effectively walk to another room without dropping audio. It also supports 24-bit 96 kHz studio quality sound over the 2.4 GHz wireless connection, double that of normal gaming headsets and something that was previously only available over the wired mode on the HS80 RGB wireless headset. It also supports Dolby Atmos on PC, as well as PS5's Tempest 3D audio spec out of the box. Battery life is pretty amazing with this headset. While utilizing the 2.4 GHz wireless mode, you can expect to get around 65 hours of battery life, or around 24 hours if you're taking advantage of the limited RGB on the outside of the ear cup. But over on the Bluetooth side of things, you can get up to a whopping 130 hours of overall listening time. The omnidirectional microphone on the left side of the headset can be bent slightly towards your mouth to allow for better vocal pickup and just as easily flipped upwards to mute when not in use. It also supports NVIDIA broadcast technology on PC that utilizes AI to reduce unwanted external audio while also amplifying your voice. This feature requires an RTX 2060 graphics card or later. The Corsair IQ software gives you the ability to tweak things such as EQ presets, enable the NVIDIA broadcast feature for the microphone, update device firmware, adjust the RGB lighting on the outside of the ear cups, and more. 
This headset features great all-around sound quality for gaming, music, movies, and more across a variety of platforms. It is an incredibly comfortable headset which can be worn for hours on end thanks to its floating headband design and breathable ear cups. The SteelSeries Arctis Nova 7 gives one of the company's most popular headsets a refresh, maintaining the comfort and ease of use. Comfort is everything with this headset offering, as SteelSeries did away with the leatherette ear pads that they used to use on the Arctic Nova Pro and went back to using air weave fabric on the ear pads that are very comfortable and won't make your ears sweat. Also, the headband is not overbearingly tight, causing you to get headaches after long sessions. Instead, they loosened up the band just enough to feel secure without feeling like they are squeezing your head like a melon. And this is especially noticeable for people who wear eyeglasses. The headset sounds better than the Arctic 7's last outing, which couldn't have been an easy test, so cheers to SteelSeries on this. This headset is good for console players as the sound that these headphones generate sound pretty good right out of the box. PC users, however, have the use of the SteelSeries software to make additional sound tweaks. The microphone is attached with a bendy wire that makes finding the right spot of your mouth easy. This is a great gaming headset offering and is my pick for most comfortable gaming headset. The G Pro X2 comes with two pairs of ear pads, one covered in soft leatherette and one in velvet fabric. They're both equally comfortable, but if you've ever struggled with heat buildup or you need a material that's a little friendlier for using with glasses, then having the Belvoir Fabric ear pads as a bonus is a win. The Logitech G-Hub software will give you access to a handful of meaningful features like DTS Headphone 2.0 Virtual Surround Sound, a 5-band equalizer, and Logitech's Blue Voice Microphone Suite. You also gain access to firmware updates and an audio sampler that seems to be aimed towards people who like to always have like a uh, air horn sound available at the push of a button. This headset has three primary methods of connection. Wired using a 3.5 millimeter jack, Bluetooth, and wirelessly using 2.4 gigahertz USB dongle. If you're gaming on PC or PlayStation 5, the USB dongle is the way to play. The 3.5 TRRS connection makes for a reasonable companion if you've got an Xbox or handhelds like Nintendo Switch or a Steam Deck. Bluetooth is primarily used to listen to music from another device like your phone while you are gaming. The microphone sounds pretty good. It's no podcasting mic, but sounds pretty good compared to a lot of the other headsets out there thanks to the Blue Boy software suite, which lets you equalize the mic, adjust gain, and turn on adjustable signal cleanup features like a de-esser, de-popper, limiter, compressor, and more. It's a comprehensive feature set that really rounds out the experience. If you want a high-end gaming headset with great sound, lots of features, and the ability to connect to most audio devices and multiple ear pad options for comfort, then this is the headset you should be looking at. The sound on these headphones is outstanding, and the microphone is only beaten by the Razer Black Shark version 2 Pro Wireless. This is a great package and is my pick for best wireless gaming headset.